This is a video on mathematics for the students of class 9 and we are discussing the topic today that is mensuration. Before going to the numericals, let us first look into some of the formulas here. So first we have the area of triangle with a base and a height. So the formula is half into base into height. Similarly, if you have an Colleen triangle or a triangle with all the three sides are different. So you can use um, Heron's formula to solve the sum. In order to that, we need to first find out the semi-perimeter. In order to find the semi-perimeter, you need to add the sides, the measurement of all the three sides and divide it by two. And then use this formula to find out the area of the triangle. And perimeter can be found out by just simply adding the measurement of all the three sides. Next, we have a right angle triangle. So in case of right angle triangle, we are aware that at least one of the sides should be 90 degree. So this will come to area is equal to half into base into height. And uh, thus we can find out the area of the right angle triangle. Now, equilateral triangle, we know that all the three sides are different. So, the formula is root 3 by 4 a square. And for the isosceles triangle, we have 1 by 4 into b root over 4 a square minus b square. So, in case of isosceles triangle, we know that at least two sides are equal. Uh, if a triangle is an isosceles right angle triangle, so we know that at least two sides are different. And also one of the angles is equal to 90 degrees. So such triangles can also, the area of such triangles can also be found using area is equal to half into base into height. Let us look into the first sum of exercise 16.1. The question is, you need to find out the area of a triangle with base 6 cm and height 4 cm. So we know the formula is half into base into height. So you can just apply the formula and you get 12 cm square as the answer. Similarly, we have been given a triangle whose all the three sides are different. So we can use the Heron's formula to find out uh, the area of the triangles. We know that if a triangle has all the three sides different, that means it is a scalene triangle. So first we need to find out the semi-perimeter, the formula for which is a plus b plus c by 2 and that comes to 6 cm and then area can be found out using this stated formula and there you get 6 cm squared as your answer. Next we have a triangle uh, field whose sides are 975 meter. 1050 meters and 1125 meter. If this field is sold at the rate of 1000 per hectare, find its selling price. And we are told that one hectare is equal to 10,000 meter square. So let us consider that all the sides of the triangle are different. So we know that we need to use Heron's formula to solve it. So first we need to find out the semi perimeter. So semi-perimeter can be found out using uh, by adding all the three sides, dividing it by 2. So we get 1,575. And area of the triangle can be solved using the formula. So if you solve the sum like this, you get 47.25 hectare. So we know that uh, the entire uh, area of the triangular field in hectares is 47.25. Remember, we had found the uh, area in terms of meter which we got 4,72,500 and converting it to hectares we got 47.25 hectare. Now we know that cost of one hectare is 10,000 meter square. Therefore, selling price of 47.25 hectares will be equal to 47,250. So this is all we have from the video today. We will continue in the next class.